Dear Ministers Deka and Papic, dear Secretary General Zoras, distinguished participants, it is my great pleasure to address you at this event, focusing on the importance of transnational cooperation. UNICA is the best example of a successful promoter of transnational cooperation in academia. 38 members of the UNICA network are already involved as partners in the European Universities Initiative, our flagship project, bringing transnational cooperation to an unprecedented level. Today, we have 50 European Universities Alliances involving more than 430 higher education institutions in 35 countries. And I'm very happy that by this summer, the numbers will increase to 60 alliances, uniting 500 higher education institutions. These alliances are long-term institutional transformation projects for the benefit of your students and staff, which will boost opportunities increase societal engagement and foster a strong sense of European belonging. The Alliance's long-term strategies are rooted in shared European values which they actively forge and promote. This takes place through joint programs, summer schools, massive open online courses and living labs. Great examples are the UNA Europa Joint Bachelor Degree in European Studies, the Circle U Knowledge Hub on Democracy, and the 4EU Plus MOOC on European Citizenship or the 4th M Democracy Week. There are still some challenges, many of them related to the joint provision of education. This is why next month I will present a blueprint to a European degree, our twofold objective to give students more opportunities to study and train in several EU countries in the context of a joint study program. And more importantly, to recognize their efforts by awarding them a European degree. This initiative is designed to facilitate voluntary cooperation among institutions, simplifying processes and laying the groundwork for a more interconnected and robust European higher education system. We're also working towards a European quality assurance and recognition system, which will support robust quality assurance systems across Europe. These should be the basis for trust and transparency and key enablers for in-depth transnational cooperation and seamless mobility. These initiatives aim ultimately at benefiting students and our youth, enabling them to have a stronger say. Currently, we're also piloting the Youth Check in the Commission, which is our commitment as the legacy of the European Year of Youth. Any initiative of relevance for our youth must be discussed with them first, thus further enhancing youth participation in the decision making. The involvement of UNICA in these discussions, as well as your work with communities and stakeholders, is the key to ensure the success of these mentioned initiatives. We count on you to help us shape the future of higher education in Europe. I wish you a very successful event.